Hey guys, what's up? Uh, so I'm not feeling super well today, and I, I really haven't been feeling that great the last couple days, but, uh, you know, whatever. Uh, I figured, you know, why not today? Today's the day I'll upload some stand-up comedy that I've done. Um, it's just a set that I did uh, not too long ago. Uh, it's pr pretty recent. Um, there's no video to it. I just, I kind of take my phone with me, and I record it on my phone so that I can listen back to it later and hear how bad I sucked. So I'm going to put some interesting video behind it and hopefully that makes it interesting to look at. So you're not just listening to some garbage and looking at a black screen, wondering what you're doing with your life. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if you know this about me, but sometimes I do stand up comedy. Sometimes I don't. Uh, it's not a, I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm not doing it right now. It's not a thing that I do all the time, but sometimes I do it. Uh, and I hope you enjoy what you're about to hear. And if you enjoy it, I'll upload more when I've got uh, better things to upload. <laughs> anyway, um, so I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, and, and hopefully um, we'll get back to doing some streaming soon. If you haven't yet, follow me on Twitch. Uh, link will be in, links will be in the description. Haha! -ha! And I will see you guys when I'm feeling better. Now, the next actor on the stage, a very good friend of mine. Uh, give it up for Mr. Matt Gibson, everybody. Matt Gibson! Hey, how's it going? <sighs> My name's Matt, and I found out recently that sexually, I identify as algebra, because I'm always hard as fuck. <laughs> Even if you got a calculator. Um, my brother recently had a baby, and my cousin got married not soon after that. So now the rest of my family's looking to me like I gotta make the next memory for these bitches. Like I gotta bring the family together for one last hurrah, and... I mean, it's starting to feel like there's a lot of pressure, right? It's starting to look at competition now. I have to outdo a marriage and a baby. So, I don't know, when I get around to it, my suicide's gonna be spectacular. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna make it real fucking sad for everybody. And when my grandma gets Facebook, oh boy, she's gonna have statuses to make. Uh, I think that if you've got a baby, odds are you're raising your baby wrong. I, when I have a kid, thank you, thank you, you know what? All right. Uh, when I have a kid, I'm not gonna teach it one fucking word. That kid's not leaving the house till he knows a full phrase. Like an entire phrase, and then as soon as he knows it, we're going to the airport. I'm going to take this kid to the airport on the off chance that he'll lock eyes with somebody getting on a plane and just be like, don't get on the plane. <laughs> and, and if after that he could cry like a baby, that would be amazing. That would be pride. I fucking hate magicians. If you're a street magician, go fuck yourself. They're always coming up to you, oh, would you like to see a trick? Would you like to see a trick? No. No, I would not. Because when I grew up, uh, I was told that tricks were things that old men did to get kids in their van. Yeah, all right. Fuck you. All right. That was way funnier than you guys thought it was. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> um, I don't know, fuck. They're always coming up to you, do you want to see a trick? No, I don't want to see a trick. They're just looking for reasons to release doves. You know that, right? <laughs> they've, got, they've got a cage full of doves, and they're just itching to release them. I don't know, I envy the ability, like, they just, oh, what's hire a magician for our kid's birthday? What's he going to do? Well, he's going to come in here, and he's going to tell your kid a bunch of lies, and wear a fancy hat. <laughs> and, like, doves are one one like speck of dirt away from being a pigeon, you know that, right? <laughs> Dogs are just pigeons that have a little better hygiene. This guy right here is, n you don't like it at all. <laughs> this guy's a magician. <laughs> if you don't see me after this, it's because this motherfucker did something. How come magicians can escape from straight jackets underwater and get applause but when I escape from a condom inside a woman, the party's over. There's no applause for that shit. Thank you. Thank you. Um, fuck. I like watching true crime shows a lot. Those are my favorite things. Like the ones where like, there's a rape and a murder, and then they have to reenact that shit for TV. 
It's hilarious because somebody has to audition to be the rapist. I'm telling you this joke. Uh, somebody has to audition for this, this rapist part, which means somebody had to make a call that day. And it's like, you know what? You were just rapey enough. We had a couple people who were almost as rapey, but you really were above, up, and ab up, up and above with the, the rapiness. I don't know what's worse, that or like the guy who didn't get the part and has to go home sad to his family. Like, what's wrong? Wasn't, wasn't rapey enough, I guess. <laughs> Tried my best, but it still seemed consensual. Whatever. <laughs> Fuck those guys. I'm going to make my own show where I rape people. This is not a joke about rape. This is a joke about bad acting. <laughs> I want to make that clear. Oh, uh, what else do I got? Um, I've been wearing condoms that are ripped for her pleasure, but inside out. <laughs> Fuck it, I don't care. I mean, everybody should get a turn, right? I'll do it midway. I'll be a gentleman. You can get the, you get the, the second. <laughs> All right. Fuck it. I, I'm a gentleman. Whatever. I'll take the second shift. It doesn't matter to me. Like uh, most people would probably argue that a melon I've warmed up in the microwave isn't even gonna feel it anyway. So what's the big deal? Uh, fuck. Like. What's the science behind making them more bumpy, by the way? Like, I think there's probably like a table like this in a room somewhere, and just a bunch of dudes sitting around going, I don't know, fuck. Does it feel good up there if it's bumpy? Just make it more bumpy, just bump it up. Just increase the bump levels 500 times, and we'll go from there. This charts show uh, that women enjoy more bumps than less bumps. So if we could bump, uh, I don't know where we're going. All right, thank you so much. Woo! <laughs>